We'll talk to guy that, uh, after the votes have been tallied, is going to pick up the Sports Zone Radio's player of the game. Let's grab him, number 15, the workhorse all night. Let me grab a number for you for this young man <coughs> tonight. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm looking at the wrong sheet just for a second there. Uh, running the football, 23 carries, 91 very tough yards, but one pretty electric 70-yard kick return on a free kick after the Yellow Jacket defense collected a safety. Payson had to kick off. This guy fielded it. Damon Mitchell took it back and did it in the classic way that Blue Ridge does it now, the middle wedge. There's no more, there's no more corners. There's no more uh, you know, picket fence on the outside. Can't do that anymore. Those aren't really legal anymore. So it's middle wedge for the Yellow Jackets, and Damon Mitchell got it done. Damon, congratulations on the Thank win. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, so you pick up the Sports Zone Radio's player of the game on a night that didn't feature huge numbers out of anybody. Nobody really got that big, big, big night tonight, multiple touchdowns and so on. But your team just had to go out there and fight and scrap and do what you needed to win. How do you feel? How proud do you feel about the effort of you and your guys tonight? I'm super proud of them. You know, uh, we came out in the first half, held them a lot. Uh, I got some scores. Had a little setback in the second half, but in the end, we got it. So, What was it about this team? You know, talking to Herschel a moment ago, and, and I asked him, you know, he, he kind of, you know, echoed back to me what my thoughts were that this, you know, you guys came into this thing as fired up as I've seen you in a very right. long time. What, I don't know, what was it about tonight's game that, that made it so? Um, it's, it's just a huge game for us. Uh, everybody was super excited, you know, last season, regular season game. And if we, if we won this, we got a good seed in the playoffs. So I think that was mainly it. And everybody was just super excited. Yeah, no, no question about it, Damon. They called on you to run the ball a lot, 23 times. I mean, you're not the biggest guy in the world, okay? Taking a lot of abuse, a lot of pounding, and, and a team that's known for their physicality. How tough was it running against a pacing defense? It was hard. I had to hit the holes hard or else you're not going to go anywhere. And, I mean, I, I tried, but uh, in the end, we got it, so. Yeah, yeah, you certainly did. Hatch Toyota doesn't have salespeople. Now a floor product specialist works with you, and they aren't commissioned. They're on salary, so when you're approached on the lot or in the showroom, you don't have to panic. Hatch Toyota is taking the long view. The view that involves your complete satisfaction with the whole buying experience. An experience we'd even be so bold to call happy. And buying a new car is a really happy day. Shop ahead at HatchToyota.com. Then let us know which model you're interested in and make an appointment. Hatch Toyota, keeping the white mountains rolling for 25 years. And uh, would you walk us through the best you can remember on that 70-yard uh, that kick return? It was about 70 yards out there. It was a big play. You guys got the safety. They had to kick off to you. And uh, it was a big part of the victory. There's no question about it. It's a big part of why you get the, the player of the game award tonight from, from Sports on Radio. But walk us through that 70-yard kick return on the, on the middle wedge. I think everybody was fired up from the safety mainly. And I know I was for sure. And everybody just hit their man. Got up, got locked up, and I just hit the hole. How did it feel when you finally broke through and there's a lot of green, well, as much green as the pace and field has at this late point of the season? It's pretty wore out out there, but how did it feel when you see this opening uh, and you're crossing midfield? I was, I was too excited. I just ran as fast as I could. Just, yeah, just ran as fast as I could. Well, you, 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 you ran faster than anybody on the other <laughs> side, and you got, you got the score for sure. All right, the playoffs around the corner. Uh, you might get a as high as a four seed. It, it depends. You know, Snowflake, I believe, uh, won their game tonight against Snowflake uh, uh, or against Winslow. They were the four seed. You were the five seed. Um, chance that you could jump past them, but it would seem anyway, at the very least, you're going to get a five. How, how do you and how do the guys feel about your position going into the playoffs? We're all really proud of it. Um, our season, it, was, it's not, it wasn't the best. You know, it was a perfect season, but... I'd say we're all really proud of our season. Yeah, ready for the playoffs? Yeah, we're all ready. All right, all right. good luck, Damon. Congratulations. Appreciate it, thank you. Damon Mitchell, he is the Sports on Radio's player of the game tonight. Near 100 yards rushing, and that big kick return, 70-yard kick return that put points on the board. The Yellow Jacket offense never found the end zone today, but they were able to convert on, uh, on the game-winning field goal. They got a 21-yard field goal at the end of the game. P.J. London connecting on that one tonight a victory for the yellow jackets but the 3a east region champions the payson longhorns they uh, they get the tiebreaker on the three-way tie payson snowflake blue ridge all three tying with a four and one region record and uh 
and the championship, uh, the region championship belonging to the Payson Longhorns. We're going to continue our postgame wrap up here in just a moment. Byron's going to rejoin us, folks, after in video land. This is the Sports on Radio Game of the Week presented by Hatch Toyota.